We've learned an Albuquerque bishop was ordered by a federal civil court judge to pay hundreds of thousands of dollars to a woman who accused him of being a predator. And as News 13's Gabrielle Burkhart reports on special assignment, the bishop, who is still on the job, claims he doesn't owe a dime. He's coming back. Bishop James Lakeith Jones of the Church of God in Christ, or Kojic, in Albuquerque, says he's done nothing criminal. But that doesn't change the fact that a federal court has now ordered him to pay $750,000 to the woman who claims he's a predator. Jones has been preaching in Albuquerque for years, leading the Albuquerque chapter of one of the largest nationwide churches. But on special assignment in 2016, we told you about Texas woman Kimberly Pollard's lawsuit against the bishop that reveals another side of him. You're looking mighty sexy in your nightgown. Pollard says Bishop Jones made that comment to her six-year-old daughter in a video message, just part of a series of video and text message exchanges between Pollard and the bishop that the lawsuit centered around. This one's for you. Some images are too explicit to show on TV. Pollard claims Jones preyed on her when she was a teen 20 years ago and says he sexually assaulted her in a hotel room when she was 16 years old. Then as he worked his way up the church ranks, she claims he used his authority to keep preying on her, using coercion, threats, and his position as a spiritual advisor. The bishop denies any sexual assault. Still, court documents show Pollard won a $750,000 judgment in the case. Her attorneys say Jones hasn't paid a dime and instead claims the case was thrown out. So legal assistance on the case made the trip from Texas. <laughs> to hold up this sign for Sunday parishioners. It reads, Kojic Bishop James Lakeith Jones has been found liable by a federal district court of having a sexual relationship with a child, and he is still in good standing with the Church of God in Christ. One of Pollard's attorneys told us via email it's concerning that Kojic allows Jones to continue in such a high-profile position. Jones declined an on-camera interview and called this a case of a woman scorned. He told us via email he served a year suspension with the church and doesn't owe Pollard anything because the judge didn't sign the document ordering him to pay. But we called the Northern District of Texas Courthouse and were told a judge doesn't have to sign the document. The judgment is still valid with a clerk's signature, meaning Jones still owes $750,000 plus $20 per day in interest. On special assignment, Gabrielle Burkhart, KRQE News 13. Both the Church of God in Christ and the Board of Bishops were dismissed from that lawsuit. We called the church's headquarters in Memphis to ask if Jones is still in good standing with the church. We did not hear back.